The opinions and interpretations expressed in this and other videos are that of Marty Huey and may not be representative of his colleagues and employer. The videos cover overlapping requirements of codes, standards, and regulations. Your situation will require full analysis beyond the concepts presented here. Allowable building height and area. This is off the IBC table 503. This table speaks directly to the allowable height and area a building may be, depending on its occupancy type and its square footage. That's what this table speaks to. This table has nothing to do with sprinkling a building. If you sprinkle the building, all these numbers may be increased depending on a calculation in the next section of section 500. So let's take a look at the table itself. This is only a section of the table. S stands for stories. The number of stories you may have depending on its construction type and its occupancy type, which is listed on the left. We'll cover that in a second. Now area, which I've circled here, is the amount of area you're allowed to have, and that is amount of area you're allowed to have per story. This section here speaks to its actual construction type, and you should view video number 16 in order to better understand this. This is a direct relationship to each other. One relates to the other. And again, the A and the B has nothing to do with sprinkler. Type 1A could be type 1-1, type 1-2, type 1-3. It just happens to be a different building type. So type 1A is just a different building type than type 1B, than type 2B, or type 2A. Again, nothing to do with sprinkling. This here is the occupancy type. So on the left-hand side, you have the occupancy type. These are the assembly building types. This one here is for business. And the bottom one here is for education. These all can be found in section 300. This is just a portion of the table and it continues on. Now this is the allowable building height. The number of feet above grade this building is allowed to be. Taking education, for example, E on the left hand side, and type 5, which is all wood construction. We're allowed to have one story at 40 feet high and 9,500 square feet in a single story. But we can't go more than one. Another calculation, along with all these, depending on your frontage of your road and whether you sprinkle or not, could increase the square footage you're allowed. Please post or email comments on what you've seen. Suggestions for future topics are also welcome. Marty enjoys learning from the experience of others. More videos will be added, which can be found at MartyHuey.com.